This morning, heightened security outside Buckingham Palace after police say a man threw shotgun cartridges on the palace grounds. A controlled explosion of the items carried out and the man quickly arrested. Police say the king and queen weren't there while the palace was briefly placed on lockdown. This as the nation prepares for the crowning of the royals, which is just three days away. Overnight, pomp and pageantry on full display during a large-scale rehearsal through the empty streets of London. Some 7,000 sailors, soldiers and aviators will march, leading the newly crowned monarchs from Westminster Abbey to Buckingham Palace in what will be the biggest military ceremony the country has seen in 70 years since the late Queen Elizabeth was crowned. The royal family spotted at the Abbey this morning, taking part in rehearsals themselves. Charles, Camilla, William and Kate seen arriving with their three children. Camilla's own grandchildren, who will be her pages of honor during the coronation, also joining in. In the afternoon on Tuesday, Charles and Camilla visiting Parliament, looking at the historic coach on display, the same one used in three previous coronations. The couple looking relaxed, seen engaging in conversation and receiving a warm send-off as they walked out. <laughs> The Archbishop of Canterbury, who will conduct the deeply religious ceremony, has been working closely with the king. He's very easy to work with. He is really kind. He pays great attention. He thinks very deeply about these things. With just a few days to go until the coronation, last-minute touches and preparations are underway as royal fans fly in from across the world, struggling to contain their excitement. Nobody does it like the British, the pomp and the circumstance. And like I said, we don't have anything like this in the States. And new details are emerging overnight in a newly released documentary on Charles's life. He was the boy who walked alone. Showing rare and unseen footage of the future king and his childhood in the spotlight. The queen became queen very young. And as a result, she missed... Charles is charged. And there's that story he often told about his mother coming back from a very, very long tour, and he rushes onto the royal yacht to greet her, hoping for a hug, and she just holds up her hand. The world will also be watching Prince Harry, who is set to attend his father's coronation on his own, reportedly in the country for just a few hours before heading back to California for his son Archie's birthday. The family tensions on display as the royals come together on the king and queen's big day. And guys, King Charles was beaming as he left Westminster Abbey today. Now, what we can expect over the next few days is just more of that attention to detail. I can tell you every detail will be looked over because we just have three days left until the coronation. Mm. <laughs> Grab me a little napkin or something, Megan. Those Thanks. flowers behind you are beautiful. <laughs> I got you. So. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Thanks, Megan. Appreciate it. And don't forget, we're going to bring you live coverage of the coronation beginning Saturday at 5 a.m. Eastern here on NBC and streaming on NBC News Now and Today All Day. All right, plus our Keir Simmons received exclusive access to some of the most famous royal places for the latest episode of Incredible World. You can watch it at 10.30 a.m. Eastern on our streaming channel over on Today All Day or on Peacock. No. On you never get enough of those palaces. Yeah. I, 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 I've said this to you before. Did yes. I say something wrong? You need some glasses. I'm, my appointment's next Wednesday. It said, pla it said, said places, places, but palaces. What did I say? See, I was trying to <laughs> help her out. We no, have to shame her into yes getting and, her no, eyes Yesterday, out. Craig pulled me aside after the show. He said, Chanel. It is time to get glasses. It is. it is interfering with your work. We're going to have to start watching Mr. Magoo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, speaking oh. of that, Waldo and Presley. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.